guys, it is me again, again, and again, and again, and today we're coming back with part three, and I've listened to the demand, and I want to do it again. I will post one of these every day. If you want to subscribe, if you can subscribe, I don't care if you don't, I'll just still upload. I, if you can, like, if you're just a sign-in guest, just welcome, and you can see my videos, and I love you guys. So, we left off, um, I think... You guys wanted to have the androids come back, and because Goku and Vegeta wanted a challenge, especially Vegeta, Goku was kind of hesitant at first, but he was like, but Goku, being this person he is, Cell comes out, the androids are out, Goku's really just bodying the androids at this point. Even with the legendary Super Saiyan Key, they didn't expect for them to master it. He didn't get the three years of hyperbolic time chamber training, Dr. Jerome, which was a horrible mistake in his part. So, yeah. They defeated the androids. They didn't kill him. So, the androids were like, we're no match. So, we might as well just live our lives. But, but then they got absorbed by Cell. They were living their life. They just... Sunny Perfect Cell comes out. And he has legendary Super Saiyan Key. And he can body Vegeta because he only found out... No, he can't body Vegeta. You know what? Vegeta found out, like, regular Super Saiyan grade 4. He found out regular Super Saiyan grade 4. That's, that's, wh that's what it is. That's what he found out. So, yeah. So, obviously, he found out legendary Super Saiyan grade 4. Uh, Goku and Vegeta found out grade 4 for regular Super Saiyan, not legendary. Like the Super Saiyan we see Goku turn into. So, the regular Goku from the Dragon Ball Z turn into that, that, and then he masters it. Go on as SHJ2. He, he couldn't take on Semi Perfect Cell, but he was. He could. He could beat him. But Gohan doesn't control that form like like Goku had against Frieza, Legendary Super Saiyan. So, he really didn't have as much control. So, he let him absorb. Android 18, so what? He let him resort Android 18, so now he's perfect, so. And he just bodied uh, Gohan, and Goku was watching. He was, uh, he was like, he was actually really mad at Gohan, but, you know, he was seeing what Gohan had. And Piccolo gave him that statement. Gohan does not like to fight, even though... Boma is his mom and encourages him to fight, but Gohan really just doesn't like to fight. And then Piccolo's, and then Gohan, and Goku realizes, and then Gohan just gives out. He's like, I'm just a kid, I can't. And then Goku's like, <gasps> because the Cell Juniors are taking on legendary Super Saiyan Goku grade 4, and he thought, like, he could, like, Gohan can take on because Gohan wasn't stronger than his dad, but the Cell Juniors were stronger than Goku. Wow, that makes any sense. Perfect Cell is stronger, so he could make the Cell Juniors stronger than that legendary Super Saiyan Goku. Let's just go with that one. Let's just say this for the what if. Come on, don't take it so serious. Alright, so Goku obviously just um, shocked at what his son just did. And... Cell gets angry because he doesn't like when people waste his time. And he just murders Gohan. Just murders him. Vegeta's shocked. And Future Trunks is here. But he didn't feel the need to train, which is fucking stupid. Because he thought Goku had all of it handled in the bag. Let's just say in this alternate timeline, that Future Trunks timeline can get fixed. Like this one. So, Future Trunks stays in his timeline, waiting for them to fix everything. And Goku goes SSJ, Legendary Super Saiyan 2. And this man just body cell. This time, there's no Super Perfect Cell. Super Perfect Cell wouldn't even be stronger than LSSJ 2. LS Legendary Super Saiyan 2. He wouldn't be stronger. Goku got angered, he he revived Gohan and everything. This time Goku 
I know he's using the hyperbolic time chamber a lot, but you know his time he kinda used it way too much. Let's just say he uses it like um super Ve like um Dragon Ball Super Vegeta who uses it often. So he goes to the time chamber again to train Gohan. But he finds a spark of energy. He finds the same key as him, his legendary super so Goku goes all out with his legendary super saiyan grade 4 be because he just went to do it against Cell but he could but he couldn't activate it again because you know he was just angered <clears throat> so Goku just murders like it's not not he Goku's just beating up Gohan and he's like Die. And then Gohan goes legendary Super Saiyan for the first time. Just like his father. And Goku is trying to hold him up, but Gohan is like really, really angry at him. But Goku knocks him out. He knows that Gohan isn't stronger than him, he just knocks him out. Because, you know, Goku has experience with the form and he knows what to do. So Goku obviously just stays there. He's like, my son. I'm so proud of you. Like something like that. And the main difference here is Goku didn't die. And you know how it is. Goku doesn't. Goku is supposed to die. Goku is supposed to die. I think Goku is so supposed to die in the seven year time skip. But this time, Goku actually trains with Gohan. And Gohan got Legendary Super Saiyan 2, and Goku has Legendary Super Saiyan 2. He's stronger than Gohan, but by a little teeny bit. But one day, Goku taps into the strange power. His hair just turns red, and he thinks it's his new form. So while he's in the form in the hyperbolic time chamber, he's like, "I matter. I better." just use this form before before like I before I get rid of it because he really doesn't know what the form is so he just keeps training it before it runs out but it's a, he trained with it for like a good two hours in the time chamber which is like is a lot of time so he's really kind of mastered the form so he's tapped into it again and he's fighting in it and stuff. But this time something strange happens. He absorbs it in his legendary Super Saiyan. And he's like, whoa, I'm, I'm a lot stronger. And Goku is just a lot stronger this time. So Goku destroys the Majin Buu egg and he wins the tournament. Oh, oh, one thing I forgot to say, Mr. Satan does not take credit. It is Goku who takes credit. And Goku's the savior of the earth. And Majin Buu doesn't happen because he stops the egg and Gohan trains. And so he doesn't waste. And and Vegeta didn't go Majin because... Vegeta didn't go Majin because... Um, how do you say this? Um, uh, because he fought Goku and Goku didn't die. So he didn't have to do that one last time. I want to fight you one last time, Kakarot. Thing. And... So, this time, Vegeta, Gohan slacks off on his training a little bit. Goku understands. Some people on the what-ups are like, Oh, Gohan, Gohan does not slacks off on his training. And since Goku's there, they all think he's like, Alright, Goku fixes everything. But it's not like that. Goku wants to, um, Gohan wants to focus on his scholarship stuff, but he can take on Deborah with one-handed. So he takes out Deborah and Goku and Bobbity is like very scared. And then Piccolo takes out Bobbity. Right? No Gotenks happens. And no Goten and Trunks Super Saiyan because that just fucked up the value of Super Saiyan in my opinion. So we're not going to do that. So. And here we are in the Beer Saga. Goku still trains in the Hyperbolic Time Chamber, which is a lot unhealthy for him. Because a day is a year, so one one time, he spent seven whole days in the time chamber, just by himself. 
and he just walks out like nothing happened. And he has like, he has some blue hair. He has blue hair. He has blue hair. He grown, he grown back his tail because he's legendary Super Saiyan. He grown back his tail. He came out with blue hair, which we all know is Super Saiyan Blue, which he is a lot stronger than Beerus. Even at, even Beerus at Ultra Instinct, I think he couldn't beat Goku in this timeline. But Goku absorbed Super Saiyan Blue into his legendary Super Saiyan 2 state, which literally makes him like so overpowered. He's way stronger than Broly in the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie. He's way stronger than Jiren. He's way stronger than his Master Ultra Instinct self. So imagine that Goku with Master Ultra Instinct. He would literally, I think he would rival, I think he would rival um, Beerus or Whis. But I'll see you in the next part. This is part three and I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye bye.